Hi everyone, it's me Susan. I'm back with another fun science-based family link. If you want to do this with me, first check with your parents, then grab these items and put me on pause. You're going to need a half a cup of vinegar, three tablespoons of baking soda, and that's all you're going to need. So put me on pause. And we'll come back in just a moment. Welcome back. Today we're going to talk about forgiveness. Our Bible verse comes from Matthew 6, 14. For if you forgive other people when they sin against you, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. When we cannot forgive, we bottle up the anger and hurt inside. It doesn't go away. Rather, it builds and grows and has repercussions on our personal well-being. Not forgiving is like drinking poison and expecting something to happen to the other person. What is forgiveness? It is freeing someone from the debt of whatever offense they committed against you. It's not the right to get even. What forgiveness is not, it is not minimizing what has been done to you. It's not letting the person off the hook. You need to be honest about the hurt and it is okay to sometimes let them experience consequences. It's not putting yourself back into a position where you can get damaged again. You do not need to put yourself in harm's way because you chose to forgive. It's not forgetting what happened either. Why do we forgive? We forgive because the Bible asks us to forgive. We also forgive over and over again because that is exactly what God does for us. Let's pretend this cup is your body. Now we're going to pour the vinegar in. And this vinegar is all your emotions, all nice and calm and clear. This baking soda is all the mean things that someone has done to you. When we put the mean things inside of you because you are hurt by what was said or done to you, you get angry and things fester up inside of you. Just like this. You ready? You boil over with emotions and you get angry. If we don't forgive, it harms us just like this. The hurt and anger grows and we suffer. The eruption found in the vinegar and the baking soda is a visual of how our anger detonates due to lack of forgiveness. This can result in a verbal or physical response or in an inward explosion that can lead to sadness. This is why we forgive. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we ask you to give us the strength to forgive those that have sinned against us. Guide us and help us learn from these situations. It's in your name we pray. Now go give this experiment a try. And we'll see you next time. Bye.